Yo, yo, yo! What's up, everybody? My seat's going down. Go up. There we go. Today I thought we'd slow it down a little bit because I feel like I haven't really had the chance to stop and talk to you guys for a little while because the last week's been pretty hectic. We've had fingerboard week. It's been really crazy. And the last knee update video I did was around... Hmm... Like three months ago? Like, I haven't made an update video in a long time. And a lot's changed, really. As it does, a lot changes in three months. Well, it can, and it has. So, first things first. My knee. If you didn't know, I injured my knee at the start of the year in Japan snowboarding. I hit a jump and I undershot it and I tore my ACL and if you don't know what an ACL is, an ACL is the ligament in your knee which stops it from doing this movement and if you don't have it then you're really unbalanced and impacts can hurt quite a bit and it just kind of sucks. I had a surgery to repair that at the start of the year and it's been around seven or so months now. Pretty much seven months of just going at rehab and trying to get stronger so I can snowboard again. Because funnily enough, this is actually a snowboarding channel if you watch me at the start of the year. Obviously things have changed because of circumstances, but the end goal, I really want to get back to snowboarding again, and that's what I've been striving for at the gym. It feels like my knee's going really good, in case you're wondering. It feels like I could snowboard again today, but I don't want to risk it. I don't, I don't want to be an idiot and go do it and then re-injure it. I want to get the full rehab and make sure that I'm ready to snowboard again. I saw my knee surgeon the other day. He's a really cool dude, he surfs. And right now, I'm set to go see him again in November, and then he's gonna see how, how I'm doing, and if I'm doing good, then he's gonna get me tested in December, and if I pass the test, then I'm allowed to do board sports again. All right, I'm on my way to the gym, because my knee specialist told me for these last three months, I gotta freaking go hard. So that's what I've been doing. I've been pumping up all the weights. And I have this whole new gym routine, which I'll show you today. This is my knee. It still has the scar on it. I don't know about you, but the surgeon said that's not going to come off anytime soon. Let's freaking do this, guys. It's time to get swole. Red Robin. Yum. Eddie! Oh, no. Yum. Yum. Oh, crap. It's D Dave. Dave! Yes, I do have wires because I'm broke. No, I actually have the wires because I don't like Bluetooth headphones because I can't be bothered charging them every night. Yum, yum. Grab it. Yum, yum. Yum, yum. Grab it. Yum, yum. Yum, yum. Grab it. I didn't film everything because it, it was quite a busy night at the gym and there was just enough people for it to be weird to film. I'll just tell you what I'm doing different and hopefully that means something to you. But there's one thing I haven't done since I got surgery on my knee and that's try to run. <laughs> yeah! I'm fast as oh, boy! I'm fast as oh, boy! Tom's changed my whole workout routine. Now I'm doing like jumping and stuff. All the stuff that I need to do to build strength to be able to snowboard again. Leg extensions, leg curls, squats with the Smith machine, stiff leg deadlift, step up, back lunge with barbell, monster walks and jumps, box jumps, jump downs, figure eight hops, and pistol squats. That's what we're kind of working towards. Yeah, no, it's all going, it's all going good. Uh, what else is going on in my life? I'm going to Wanaka next week. Well, actually at the end of the week by the time I'm posting this. Sadly, no, I'm not going there to snowboard. We kind of just went over that. I'm going there to hang out with Kevin and TJ because they'll be in town and I haven't seen them since Japan, so it should be really fun. It's weird, I'm going to Wanaka next week. Then I'm coming back to Auckland. And then the next week after that, I'm going back to Wanaka. <laughs> the whole month of September is going to be quite packed with traveling. I've been talking to some of my friends who work up Kadrona and we're trying to get one of those sit down ski things and see if I can have a day on one of those. If you guys want to see that video, make sure to smash like. Uh, YouTube. Let's talk about YouTube. If you didn't know, the past week I did fingerboard week and it's been amazing. <laughs> the past three days we've consistently broken my channel's record 
each day. <laughs> like it is, it's actually, it's really wild actually. Last week today, my channel got 16,000 views in one day. And today my channel's already gotten 170,000 views and there's still four hours to go in the day. That kind, it, it blows my mind really. It blows my mind that so many people like watching my fingerboard videos and I'm really thankful for it. I'm not very good at showing thankfulness, but I am. <laughs> it sounds really stupid and cheesy to say, but it, al it almost feels like a dream. Ever since I hurt my knee and I couldn't snowboard anymore, my channel views have just been going down. But then for it to just go like, it's wild. <laughs> That's what it is, it's wild. I hit 130,000 subscribers. That's sick. A lot of things are happening this week. It's, it's dope. <laughs> Fingerboard week was seven days consistently every day uploading. That sentence came out weird. It was seven days in a row of uploading. I haven't been a daily vlogger since since I first uploaded. When I first started making YouTube videos, I, I uploaded every day for a whole snowboard season, and then I kind of stopped uploading every day. Then to go back to it, I forgot how much of a grind the daily vlogging life was. <laughs> like, it's hard, dude. It's hard to upload what you want to upload quality-wise every day. It's a grind. I have a new respect for people who upload daily. I think PewDiePie said it best in one of his videos. He said, YouTube is not the hardest job at all, but it's not a job that ever really stops. Like there's no nine to five hours within YouTube. It's kind of a 24 seven thing because when you're not making videos, you're thinking about the next video you're gonna make and you're always constantly checking your views. And But at the same time, I think it is definitely the best job in the world. I don't think there's anything really better than it because you can do whatever the heck you want. You can even make fingerboard videos. <laughs> and time for the part which I'm sure a lot of you have been waiting for, and that is fingerboard week part two, huh? <laughs> fingerboard week part one ended yesterday. A majority of the comments on the last video were, we want fingerboard week part two. Fingerboard week actually, it took a while to plan for. The concrete bowl which I made, that took the whole week to make. I don't really want to upload fingerboard videos every day. And it's not because I think I can't do it, but it's because I don't want to get burnt out doing fingerboard videos. Because I can honestly see it happening pretty quick. <laughs> Once you get into something and it takes up all of your day, if that keeps going for too long, then you're just gonna kind of get bored with it. And I think when you're not doing that certain thing, that's when the best ideas come to you if that makes any sense at all. But in saying that, Fingerboard Week Part 2 might come sooner than you think. <laughs> but there's gonna be a lot of fingerboard videos, even if they're not every day. Here's a little spoiler for you guys, there's gonna be one tomorrow. <laughs> and yeah, things have been pretty good. Hopefully this video wasn't too boring. <laughs> just a bit of a life update for you guys, since we haven't done one in a little while. Just for all the people that care. Also, what do you guys think of uploading every day? Because I think right now that's eight days in a row of uploading, and I'm really liking it. I'm gonna be honest, it's been good. So yeah, let me know what you think about that, and thank you guys so much for watching and all of the support. It's been amazing, and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Cool, all right, bye guys. Peace out. Oh yeah, it's pizza time. Pizza time. Oh, make sure to subscribe. <laughs> It'll take five days by car